back in the shop. Today we will be covering a dash and suede. So since I can't get the dash completely off, I'm gonna cover and tape everything off. So that way we can spray the glue down, put the suede on. Yeah, it took me a minute to get everything off, but got it off. So the car look a mess right now, but yeah, let's go ahead and get straight into it. Got most of the dash done. I'm finna go ahead and finish this part today. And then start putting the rest of the pieces back together. I also wrap these panels in carbon fiber, as you can see. I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna cover this in suede just to match the dash and the ceiling. Yeah, so it's almost done. So I'm finna go ahead and get into it now. Sit back and watch everybody else do everything, ball out, have fun, not have fun, and all that. Or just they just sit back and just watch. You know what I mean? And talk about what everybody else is doing or how he balls or this and that. Then you got the people that that wanna do it, that just don't do it. You know what I mean? Then you got the people, you know what I mean, that, that do it. All right, that's a wrap for tonight. I finally got the whole dash wrapped in suede. Tomorrow, I'll be continuing to wrap some more pieces in suede, like the floor trims right here on the passenger and driver side. And then also the trim that covers the cluster. So I'm gonna go ahead and cover that in suede. All right, so I'm down to the last stretch of getting everything in the interior wrapped in suede. These two pieces are the pieces that's connected to the back seat and then these are on the bottom floorboard and the feet. And then these two are close to the dash and center console. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started on it.
right, what's up, y'all? I finally got those pieces wrapped and suede. Got them all done. I'm probably gonna do two more, but I ran out of adhesive. And for y'all who want to know what kind of adhesive I'm using, I'm using this right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all where these pieces go. So these two back here to the back seat, cause they was tan, cause I had tan interior prior to this. So I didn't like the color. I wanted to match with the whole rest of the car. So I'm gonna grab those. And then those two little pieces that go up here. And then the four pieces that I was telling y'all about. So, and I ripped the leather off cause it was ugly. It was starting to stick out. He didn't want to stick on, so yeah, took that off. Just went to these right here, so they look completely better. So I'm gonna go ahead and start putting these pieces on. Now we can go ahead and take a look at what it looked like. It look way cleaner than what it was at first, cause at first I just had it painted. And the paint kept on coming off. So I didn't want to keep dealing with that, so. Real nice and clean and smooth. And there y'all have it.